New tonight at 5, a controversial Silent Sam statue back in the spotlight. The UNC Board of Trustees meeting to decide what happens now after the toppling of Silent Sam. The closed door meeting lasted more than four hours. The focus squarely on Silent Sam. Since the statue's illegal removal from its stoop last week, 11 people have been arrested related to protests. NBC Charlotte's Evan West has been on top of the story since Silent Sam came down last week. He is live at 5 with the latest. Evan? Well, Confederate statues here in Charlotte, like these in the cemetery, have remained basically untouched for the last few years. But in Chapel Hill, it's a much different story. A school leader saying they feel like the nation is watching their every move. We know that the monument has been divisive for a long time, but what happened on Monday was wrong. It's been more than a week and Silent Sam is still gone. The statue being stored at a secret location by school officials as school leaders work to decide what's next. You know, it has also uh, brought the eyes of the nation on us. And that, of course, is adding urgency to our own determination to find a lawful and lasting path that will protect the public. Despite UNC Chancellor Carol Folt facing pressure from students and faculty to keep the statue off campus. No platform for white supremacy! A state law passed in 2015 requires the statue to be returned to its stoop within 90 days of its removal unless the historic commission says otherwise. We will make sure that the laws of our state are enforced. Former state senator Tom Goolsby is a Wilmington member of the UNC Board of Governors. He's been very vocal about the statue returning to the stoop where it stood for 105 years. We all know our history is the history of the nation, and these are issues that we are, are very willing to talk about and have be part of our solution moving forward. So the big takeaway from today, Chancellor Folt and the Board of Trustees have been directed to put together a lawful and lasting plan to preserve the statue Silent Sam while also taking into account public safety. The school doesn't want any more protests. The deadline to present this plan, November 15th. So the clock finally ticking on Silent Sam's fate. Reporting live, I'm Evan West for NBC Charlotte. All right, we know you'll be tracking it closely, Evan. Thank you.